Hello YouTubers. Well, I find that in a couple of weeks I'm coming up to my 84th birthday, which um, <laughs> is a milestone, believe you me. But also I'm coming up, or, or I think I have just passed, the fifth anniversary of me being here on YouTube. And um, I just really think I should celebrate that by... Uh, by saying how uh, grateful that I am to YouTube for all of the opportunities that I've had to meet so many people and the friendships that all of you have have shown me and um, I hope I may be able to continue for some little time longer. Um, I read my comments and I see names of people I've known from a long time ago, but many of my contemporaries, they seem to be uh, grumbling that YouTube is not like it was in the old days and uh, there was a smaller community and it's all got too commercial and uh, they're not getting the attention that they um, they used to. Well, um, so what? Life goes on. Uh, YouTube has expanded into a massive organisation and, um, I mean, <laughs> live with it. <laughs> but, um, woke up this morning with the blues all round my bed. My YouTube is just about dead. Oh, Chad, it's so sad. What should I do? I was top of the pile for a while, now my viewers are fewer. I'm no longer fit, I'm just an old git. Old oh, Chad, what should I do? I could hire a cat. Should I do that? To act kinda cute, would that be the route? I could find a baby. Well, maybe, with whom I could play. But perhaps I should pretend to be gay, what do you say? I could speed up my voice. Would that be the choice? Oh, Chad, what can I do? Yes, of course things have changed uh, uh, since um, uh, five years ago as uh, YouTube has got, uh, got much uh, larger and larger. And yes, of course it's commercial. I mean, how on earth can a, a company that big with all the resources that they have to have um, survive without? Um, getting sort of commercial interest and adverts and YouTube have been very generous in uh, uh, to all of us um, uh, subscribers to the site um, they have uh, a partnership which they open and offer quite readily to large number of people who get who get paid for their videos and uh, have an income from it uh, they have no need to do that why would they need to do that they would still prosper and survive without doing that but they have uh, they have given back to the community um, uh, things in the form of um, monetary rewards which i think is is wonderful and of course some people um have become um uh, you know quite um uh, quite prosperous from it um, when i first came on uh, youtube i got a lot of attention and because i got a lot of attention i was number one in the world on the site for some time but that can't uh, that can't continue um, nowadays people uh, have better cameras they have uh, the skills to do wonderful editing with expensive software and uh, they produce entertaining videos and and it's quite right that they they should get attention I suppose it's rather sad that there are many people who also do things perhaps equally good that don't get the necessary attention but their their um, their fan base will will grow over time anyway as far as I'm concerned I um, I'm very grateful that YouTube have uh, enriched uh, this life of mine for five years and I think perhaps I could um, uh, express my thoughts by showing you just a little clip of the end of a speech that I delivered to a university recently and um, that uh, expresses my thoughts about my love of YouTube. So uh, with that I will say um, 
goodbye and uh, hope that I will see you again for a long time. So until then, say goodbye. Um, young people ask questions and I give a video answer once a month to them. So I have a lovely communication with, uh, with young people and I watch them develop and grow as I do my own grandchildren and I've seen them uh, as we talked about earlier, I've seen them go from their high school to their universities and to all oh, very prestigious jobs and so that's a great joy as well. Um, however, uh, I think uh, that's fairly near the end. What I'd like to do, uh, I'm going to finish off in a minute with another little video that I hope will amuse you. Uh, but after that, if you care to ask me any questions, of course I'd be pleased to develop anything further. Um, Andy Warhol said that everyone has 15 minutes. Well, I don't think that's really true, but of course I have had mine, and who would have thought that a lonely old man sitting in a little wooden bungalow in the hills of Derbyshire would have dined at the Ritz, met royalty, travelled to many parts of the world, met important people, recorded songs, appeared on television, and had so much love heaped upon him. So that's it. If we could show, just to lighten the mood a bit, <laughs> show the senior, uh, the, um, what is it called? Senior moments. This is a video that I made with some, again, some YouTube friends, um, one of whom is my webmaster actually, and uh, uh, we swapped bits of this poem backwards and forwards till we came up with this.